I don't want to live through another Republican administration. I don't know about you. <laughs> Honest to goodness, you know, how many times can you yell at your TV screen? <laughs> how often can you just say, I don't believe it? I mean, if, if you were to read a script of the last eight years, it would be hard to think it actually happened. I mean, it's not only the big issues and concerns that we all are so committed to changing, from the war in Iraq to the economy and everything else, but this administration has damaged our country in so many ways, large and small. And I only hope that when we finally put a Democrat back in the White House next January, we will be able to make the economy work for hardworking Americans and middle class families again. <laughs> that we will be able to end the war in Iraq and bring our troops home as quickly and responsibly as possible. And I am looking forward to being at the White House when President Obama signs quality, affordable health care for every single American. Of us could stand up and recite all the reasons why we must elect Barack. The Supreme Court is at stake. Our educational system needs the right kind of change. We've got to become energy independent. We have to create millions of new green collar jobs. We've got so much work to do around the world. None of that will happen if John McCain is in the White House. I just want to make it absolutely clear, we cannot afford four more years of George W. Bush's failed policies in America, and that's what we would get with John McCain. Now, I understand that the McCain campaign is running ads trying to divide us. And let me state what I think about their tactics and these ads. I'm Hillary Clinton, and I do not approve that message. <laughs>